Hello everyone, it's Megasan Fjord and today, today I will show you a tutorial how to install Limeage OS on your Galaxy S4 device. So as far as I know, Cyanogen mod is dead and its successor is called Limeage OS and it has been discontinued just before New Year. So in this device I'm currently running, running Limeage OS and I will show you that. So this is the most newest, newest version, Android 7.1.1 and this is Lineage OS updates. So you can just click on that and uh, you can see that you can check for updates. Just click on that, data connection is required. So anyway, you can download all the updates here and here is the the model device, Android version, and here's the most essential information, Lineage OS version, which is 14.1, same as it was on Cyanogen mod, which me meant that 14 version, version with the number 14, means that this is already the version 7.0 or above. So this 14.1, which is 7.1.1. This is the build date and all information. So Galaxy, so for that you will have to recover into um, recovery mode. And what you have to do, you click on the volume down, power button, and and the home button and the power button. So home down, home button, and the power. So I will do right now. And uh, just just before that, I will show you that the device is working really nice, and I installed. Uh, Galaxy, uh, not Galaxy, but Google Apps with, a, as I remember, micro variant. So it's working really nice, really fluently. It has many interesting things, stuff like security with a uh, smart lock. So it has, for example, such features like Okay, like onboard detection, trust places, trusted devices, trusted face, trusted even voice. So these are really interesting things to consider. And the device is working really, really nice and fluently, really fast without any problem. And um, yeah, I can show you even Google. So it's working really nice. Okay, so let's do that. Just a second. So I'm just powering it off. And it's really sad news that CM is dead. I'm sorry guys, but probably they had to move on. There was a conflict. Okay, now we click on the volume down, home button and the power button. And we click that on the same time. And wait a little bit when, just a second. Okay, now after clicking, in fact, volume up, home button and the power button, the system goes into recovery. This is Team Win Recovery Project. What you do next, before installing any new ROM system, whatever, you click on the wipe and then swipe to factory reset. And then when you swipe, you will see that the whole system is um, erased, except the files. And after doing that, you will have to install the system by clicking on the downloaded file, which is Lineage OS, unofficial. And so I will show you that. You click on that, and it shows that one of max 10 files quit for installing zip so you add more zips and now you will add open gaps 
in this case this is a mini so you click on that and now you will be able to see two of max 10 files quit so after doing that swipe to confirm flash so you just click on that and then the system will finish it this work and after doing that uh, it you will have to reboot it will show you uh, like this system power off recovery download so reboot the system we will be rebooting the system so reboot that and then you will be able to see that the new system is booted so this is not my first time for the first time just wait like three to 10 minutes maximum 10 minutes of course but in this case as I remember it was like three three minutes or maybe even less but it could be on different devices different so this is the android it's picking up and this is the usual time it boots up so here we go okay the pin code Okay, so here we go. And this is our system. And guys, for that, you will have to download the files, which you will find just clicking on the Google search bar with the clicking um, Lineage OS S4. Then click Enter. And then you will be able to see the official and uh, okay so this is this one Galaxy S4 Lineage OS Nougat and I will uh, put that description link uh, the link in the description so you can see that this um, variant this Galaxy ROM for Galaxy S4 fits into few models uh, i9500, 05, 05G, 06 so here we go before starting so make sure that install USB drivers for a device on your PC this will be a Samsung later Samsung USB uh, drivers so you have to down type in download Samsung USB drivers or driver then click on uh, I think that the best one is this one because usually I've been downloading it from here and you can see even according to the device name so in this case Galaxy S4 we're looking and uh, we a second we will be able to see that okay galaxy s4 so that's it galaxy s4 all variants click on that and click download and then proceed with a download click here okay so probably I have to click on different side and anyway you will be able to download that so oh begin download so what you have to click is to begin download in here we have the Samsung USB driver and so the next thing you have to do is be sure to back up your data including content contacts SMS MS and um, etc and also try to put all the de device data on your SD card or whatever uh, device you have. Make sure your device is well charged. Uh, ideally, the battery level should be around 60-80%. The more, the better. And USB debugging should be enabled on your device. So uh, guys, I will show you how to do that. So it's not that simple at the first case. So you click here then click uh, about device and um, as a member on a base burned version or 
second build date build number i guess yes on a build number you click for many times and then you, you see notification you have enabled developer options so you click on that and then you search for the debugging so under debugging you click on yes yes so that must be ticked and uh, most of the customer will not have google apps in them so make sure to to download google apps because you will not be able to use it normally at all so and how to install this is instruction so how i showed you and then this is the installation files so thank you guys for watching and i uh, hope you enjoyed my videos so make sure to like subscribe and comment below peace out